ja, es ist nicht die beste Vorbereitung, ohne Frage. It was definitely not the best preparation for our players. But what matters most is that we arrived well, even if we were severely delayed. And this is our goal. And there are no excuses allowed. We have objectives, things that we want to achieve. Yesterday, you know, the team trained a little bit in order to move a little bit. We arrived, we were tested, and then we went to the hotel. And then this morning, we did what we wanted to do yesterday. We moved a little bit, tried to get used to the climate. And then this afternoon, we will have our final training session. And then we prepare the team for the opponent. Sorry, I did not activate the microphone. Well, same procedure for every match. When we play in the Bundesliga or the Champions League or the Club World Cup, we have an assessment center within Bayern Munich. So we prepare for the opponent. We look at what the opponent looks like. We talk about the opponent within the training staff. And then during our last training session, there are things that we tell our team. Unfortunately, we do not have a lot of time, but we want to leave our team um, by itself so it can, you know, be mentally prepared, mentally fit. Al Hali is a team that has a good playing ability. They are uh, very quick in the defense, but they have also uh, very strong wingbacks. I like the way the wingbacks play. They have a pressing game and a head coach that is very impressive. Very impressive in his way um, of training, but also very impressive with um, how he trains the team, how he wants to correct their faults. I mean, it is a team that is continually improving and learning. They're a very good team. I just met the head coach personally, and he's an, a very impressive person. We know how we want to play football. And our tactic led us to win many matches. First of all, we have an idea, but obviously it's always very important to keep an eye on the opponent. And some things may change within the match because we need to adapt. And this is what we will do in this semi-final. For our team, um, for the whole staff, you know, our overarching aim is that we participate in the Club World Cup. And that is why it is our objective to win this match. We know that there is um, a extra workload, but we just want to play this match, have the same motivation, be determined to win the match. This is a very important, predominant objective to win the sixth title. I know that we have to perform at a very high level. And then, you know, yesterday, traveling, I mean, we have to let things that happened in the past be in the past. Yeah, I mean, obviously I was not very happy about what happened um, to be stuck in the plane. And I mean, we were there on time. Um, I just want to make sure that you know that we were on time in the plane, that we were ready to take off. But, you know, those are things that I don't know why they happened the way they happened. But it was not very pleasant, but that's the way it was. And now we have to turn to the future. We are very much looking forward to play the semifinals. And today, you know, the, the team will try to relax, um, regain energy so that we can win the match for us. This is our objective. And I will try to ignore everything else. You can't change the past.
we can only influence the future. Thank you very much. Actually, talk to them tonight, and obviously, I trust my players. It's their responsibility to perform, and they are old enough. They know um, how to deliver, how to rest, how to recharge their batteries, and that is why I will not um, make the rounds of their hotel rooms to make sure they are asleep and they rest and they don't watch TV. I trust my team. We have a very um, important objective and I trust them that they don't take unnecessary risks. Yeah. In terms of preparation, first of all, we won the Champions League and we played many matches every three days and that is why we prepare for the match that is ahead of us. So we'll focus on the first match first and then on the second match and then on the third match. Friday we were playing against Hertha BSC in the German Bundesliga and then now we will focus on the semi-final. So we will start preparing today for tomorrow's match. I mean, when you are in football, you have objectives and when you reach your goals, you have another objective. I think that we've done an outstanding job. We have always focused on the next aim. Now we won fifth, uh, five titles and my team and my training staff, they, con they continue to evolve. They always want to do, take the next step. And I... I've mentioned this on several occasions that success means that you continue to work and everybody needs to participate in order to succeed. And currently I can tell you that we have a very good mix, but also a very good mentality within the team, good atmosphere. And you've seen, if you had seen the players in the plane, I mean, they were very, very professional. They adapted to the, to the situation quickly. And now we need to always focus on our next aim, do the best out of the situation. We continue to learn from our past mistakes. And it is important to us that we take the next step, that we continue to evolve. That is very important in sports. Obviously, there are certain things that we need to do better and we will. First of all, I am happy that I can work with Bayern Munich, with a team that has a lot of potential. And I think that we will see after this tournament who is the best team in the world. And we are right now the best team in Europe. And such an international match or tournament such as the Club World Cup helps us to uh, play against um, international opponents and our overarching aim is to win the title, obviously.